what up gamers welcome back to the series the penultimate episode of minecraft survival episode 49 can you believe it next episode is the world tour the minecraft survival season 2 finale even so we need to get this world ready polish it up for the world tour next episode Today I want to do a bit of terraforming, get a full diamond beacon and just make sure that this world is as ready as it can be. But first, I need to show you guys something. So, under here, I've always had the idea to make it like a secret tunnel. I forgot to turn this to quartz, so I'll do that later. So we can come through the pool... And it takes us straight into the secret shout out laboratory and I love it. I think it's a really good concept. I added a pack. Alright gamers, so last episode when I was deciding where to put the statue, I considered putting it here in this spot. And that was because it's really empty here, which I do not like. And we can't have such an empty spot in this world. For sure I could just do some azalea trees, more moss patches. But I've done that. I want to do something different. So I'm going to start to get to work on building a pond. It's going to be a random shape. It doesn't have to be incredible. I just want it to look natural. That's not bad. Maybe take that out. I actually like that. Alright, so here's what we're going to do then. I'm going to dig some of the floor out a little bit here. Just just a little bit of coarse dirt. Just to, just to mix it up a little bit. Oh, we got a little bit of coarse dirt going on. Now I guess we just fill the pond up with water. Alright gamers, so I decided to do a bit of terraforming and this is what I came up with. Alright, what do we think? We got a bit of podzo, a bit of coarse dirt, some lovely little flowers, a pond and even a waterfall. I, I actually like it. I feel like it takes up this area. Like, like I said, I could have put a moss patch there. But... This is different and I like it. It's really good. I really am happy with it. We'll definitely put a path leading up to it from here though. Next up, I think what I want to do is make some rocks almost. I want to make different rocks. So, I can do a few blocks. Mixed in with a slab or two. You see, that looks pretty good. And I feel like I can do that for all different types of stone. What about a staircase? Would a staircase spoil it? Yes. Yes, definitely it does. Over here, yeah, over here where it's empty. I want to have them all in different shapes and like sizes and stuff. So I'm going to make this one little bit bigger so maybe something like that um yeah yeah that don't that don't look too bad i suppose so we got some rocks i want i want a granite rock let's do granite so where's the granite one gonna go how about right here yeah this one's gonna be another smaller rock Similar to this one, but different at the same time. So we have a small rock, a medium-sized rock, and a gigantic rock. All made out of different materials. I'm really liking this terraforming project. Gamers, I'm back after a while. And I've added some more of the rocks around the base. We have one there, one over there. We have a couple near the storage building. There's a diorite one. There's a granite wrong. Up here where all the farms are. I don't know if I want to have anything here. I feel like at this point the base kind of just ends. 
I've always considered a path wrapping round or a wall. And I think it's finally time I've made my decision. We will be doing a wall. The base just kind of ends, so a wall only makes sense. Anyway, as well as adding rocks, we need to add some street lights around here. So, I could have gone for the design I went for in Season 1. But it looks a little early game. I'll put a picture of it up on screen. So instead, we are going for a pretty late game design. With stone brick walls, sea lanterns, and then stone brick slabs. I've been in the ocean for a bit, and I have sea lanterns. Silk touch really Gamers, helps. Hear me out. I've been busy. We have these brand new lamppost street lights, whatever you want to call them, placed all around our base. It goes all the way up to the farm district to where the wall is. It goes around the wheat farm. It's all near the house. It's all up at the statue. Next main thing I want to do today is get a diamond beacon. Get rid of all these emeralds. Diamond beacon. So I'll be back in like four hours. <laughs> oh, what have I got myself into? Never again. I am so glad that that will be the last strip mining trip in this world. Little did I know. You'll see, you'll see. There's been so many and it's so boring. This better be worth it. So we can make we can make over 99 diamond blocks. So let's get to work on doing just that. We literally have so many diamonds. Okay. I don't think this is going to be enough. We'll wait till the rain clears and then we'll go out and hope for the best. Nice clear sky. And here we go. It's time to take out the beacon. Oh, I'm going to miss it. But it's long gone. Okay. Now we got to take all of these emeralds down. To replace them all with diamonds. And here we go, gamers. The diamond blocks are now being placed. I am excited. The emeralds are coming down. I would sell them to our mending villager if he was still alive. That would have been the perfect way to end the series, wouldn't it? Oh, I could just see it now. So much mending books in my inventory. A master tier mending villager. Oh, that would have been so good. But, unfortunately, he passed away. Or despawned. People are saying that he despawned. I'm going to say that it's that. I never knew you had to name the creature. Oh, tell me this is... Oh, my God. This is not going to be enough diamond blocks, I don't think. No way is this enough diamond blocks. We'll take out all these emeralds. Replace them with diamond. I literally have less than half a stack left. But this. Oh yes. This looks incredible gamers. Do you think it's a bit excessive how many blocks you need. Just for a diamond beacon. This isn't enough diamond blocks. I'm literally gonna cry. Like, seriously. I hate strip mining. It's the most boring thing in Minecraft. But it has to be done. No way. No way are we gonna get this diamond beacon finished today. 
Oh. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Oh. 16 left. Here it goes, gamers. Three, two, one. Look at that. Oh, that's incredible. Oh, that's incredible. Oh, oh, I love it. I love it. I'm so happy we can end this series like this. Something else I probably should show you guys. Okay. So, I'm happy we have the diamond beacon, but there's another thing I should probably show you guys. Is it the red line? Well, that's something, but that's not the main thing. This is here to show... This is the end of the base. This is where all the decorating and terraforming stops. It's over here, really. The Chunk Destruction Project is going to be left unfinished. I made it down to Y level 38, I'm pretty sure it was down there. I even had to move the beacon to do it. But it's going to be left unfinished this season. Definitely. It's going to be left unfinished. We're not. We're just not going to be able to finish it. It's not going to be possible. And well, that's that. I think this world is ready. There's still a few blank spots which haven't been terraformed or anything like that. But I'm fine with it. The reason I wanted to add some decoration over here but not over there. This is more of a centerpiece, right? Like the nether portal, the statue. It's really close to the house. Okay. Well. Here we go then, gamers. Here we go. The penultimate secret shout-out laboratory winner is Gamer Boy. So congratulations, Gamer Boy, on making it into the secret shout-out laboratory. If you want to make it in for yourself, you only have one more chance. Like, subscribe, and comment on this video. If you don't comment on this video, you have a lower chance of being chosen, because this will probably be the first video I check. And that's it. This world is ready. Pretty much, we've got the pond in place, we've got the lights, we have the rocks, we've got the diamond beacon, we've done some work on the chunk. This world is ready. Next episode is episode 50, the tour finale. And you're not going to want to miss it, it's going to be the end of Minecraft Survival Season 2. So to ensure you don't miss the episode, subscribe with post notifications turned on. Episode 49 is over. Thank you so much for watching. Appreciate the support. Goodbye, gamers.